hello loves welcome to today's video we are going to begin this head together girl so let's go ahead and jump right in this is the unit that i'm going to be showing you it is a hd lace frontal wig it does have hd lace and the closure is a five by five closure so this is what the inside construction looks like you have your clips in the inside and your adjustable strap to tighten it up so this wig does not come with the knots bleach so I am going to add some foundation in the inside to kind of camouflage those knots. I did not feel like going through the step of bleaching the knots. Now I'm going to take my hot comb just to apply some heat to tame any flyaways and to get the hair to go in the direction that I want it to go in. So this is what the unit looks like once I just place it on my head. And now we're just going to cut the lace and go ahead and tack it down. So I am going to, before I tack it down, I am going to pluck a little hair from the hairline. It was a little too thick for me. And then after I finished the wig, I'm like, oh, I should have plucked a little bit more. But this portion right here is like very optional. You don't have to do this but I do like to pull the wig down on my forehead you have to be careful to make sure you don't pluck your actual edges because I've done it before so make sure you pull the wig down if you're going to be plucking the hair while you have the wig on now with my bow hole liquid gold I'm going to apply it and let it dry just a little bit while it is drying I'm going to go ahead and cut away the lace and I like to use these little scissors simply because I can get a more precise cut and I like to cut a jagged edge so now I'm just going to go ahead and get the placement of the wig right and I'm going to use my cool settings on my blow dryer to dry the wig and I'm also going to apply my band to help melt that lace. Alright so we have our band on and I'm going to let this sit while I straighten the hair and I'm just going to go through it with my hot comb and also my flat irons. Um, mainly the hot comb in this area right here. But everything I've shown you prior to this moment right now is all you have to do to apply this unit. I try to keep it as simple as possible for like a lot of beginners. If you just want to get your wig and wear it straight out the box, this wig is definitely for you. Of course, like I said, if you want the knots to be um, a little bit less visible definitely bleach the knots but you don't have to do that the density on this unit is 150 percent density meaning that it's not as full so if you like you know less full hair more natural looking units definitely lean towards 150 percent density also i feel like this density is good for the summertime i don't know about y'all but i don't like for one rocking wigs in the summertime it's already just like it's already a lot <laughs> because something on your head it just makes me hotter let me just speak for myself so let me get my clip so i can talk to y'all so i'm going to take fairly big sections um it's already straightened i just want to get like all the kinks and bends out from it being in the packaging however what i was saying was in the summertime i get super hot and I like wigs that doesn't that's not as full but still give you that fullness and this wig definitely gives it to you so yeah this density is perfect for this time of the year I know me I just be getting hot and I ain't got time for no thick wig on my hair but they do have a variety of densities if this is not the look that you are going for if you like you know you like that more full look definitely check out the website because they do have other densities that would fit you and suit you so i'm just going to go through and straighten the hair big sections not really taking my time with the passes simply because this unit comes already straightened so you don't have to do too much to it again the length is 18 inches so that's also going to give you that natural look as well to make sure i don't have any humps and lumps i like to go in with my hot comb at the roots so you can either take a wax stick and you just press down and you see how it just gets it flat and just to show you we're going to see how well it curls even though this is a straight wig and typically with straight wigs 
I feel like they don't hold a curl as long as you would with like a body wave or something like that. But I want to curl it and see, you know, like how well it curls. Just in case you want to switch it up one day, you know. So we're just going to curl one piece. Okay, so you can definitely get some nice loose curls with this. Definitely love that. Love it. And I am going to pluck out a little bit of hair right here for my baby hairs. And I haven't used this technique in a while with curling the baby hairs to just get it to go in a direction that you wanted to go. It just it just makes the baby hairs look so much better when you curl it. I don't know, it just does something. So that's what I'm doing and then later on I realized that I really didn't have to do baby hairs and I really didn't like how it looked with baby hairs. However, you know, I'm going to show y'all how to do your baby hairs if you want them. So I'm just slicking them down with some foam and cutting a little bit more hair off. So this is how we are looking. I am going to take my foundation powder and apply some to the parting in the middle. And that is basically it guys. And I'm also going to apply some of that powder foundation to the edge just to help camouflage everything. Because let me tell you again, I did not bleach the knots. So if you bleach the knots, it's definitely going to take the wig up a couple more notches and you're not really going to be able to see those knots. However, if you are a beginner, I'm pretty sure you're not, you know worried about bleaching no knots and all of that and you just want to know how to apply the wig to get it to look as natural as possible without bleaching the knots and this is what you can do but it turned out really nicely as you can see like the density of this wig is really nice if you're looking for like a natural density but thank you guys so much for watching i will see you in my next video make sure you check the links below Say you change, but baby, I know.